What's up guys? I'm Rodolfo Cardenas. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Season 1, Episode 12 of Spider Month. Now, I'm just going to cut down to the chase. Um, we all know that if you get bit by a radioactive spider or any spider like the Black Widow or any spider in particular, of course, you'll die. Um, of course, there's no such thing as um, web swinging. Um, and nobody can actually climb a wall unless of your, unless if you're good at rock climbing. And yes, you guys, I bet most of you guys know where am I going with this as you refer today's title, um, th uh, title and thumbnail. What if Spider-Man, uh, was real? Now, if you guys recall on during my Vlogmas series, I... I did two videos. I said, what if King Kong was real? And what if the Grinch was real? And of course, I've got to say, the King Kong video uh, was one of the, the best videos I've ever done on my channel. Um, if you guys would ask me, the Grinch, not so much. Um, but anyways, let's get back what... Uh, and, uh, let's get back uh, in topic here. Okay, so if Spider-Man was real, um, that would be way too much for him. I feel like it would be way too much for him because A, um, there's always going to be crimes everywhere, even in New York. Um, let's say if, uh, if, a, if a tall building uh, burning and if Spider-Man uh, saves everyone from the burning uh, building, for example. And then there's going to be more crimes. And then his brain will be like super exhausted. Like it would be like, like it would pretty much like this, pretty simple. Like, oh, oh man. Um, my brain is going to be rotten. Whew, I need a breather. Think of it as like this. You're, you're working, you're working like, Almost sixteen hours with with no with no rest, like like in construction, for example, and um, it will be way too too much for him. That's that's number one. Number two, um, I don't think that it would he would survive it in the real world. Here's why: because obviously there's some. Um, bad people out there and he would uh, he's gonna lose like I, I just don't see like I just don't see him like defe defeating like defeating like the like the the world's greatest criminals or whatever I don't think he would see I don't think he would uh like manage to, to defeat them just like how he defeats uh the other bad uh villains like the Kingpin, for example, or um, the Green Goblin, or Doctor Octopus, for example. I don't think he would have like win because there's more crimes everywhere, like I said. And that's and that's that's number two. Number three. It's literally impossible for, for to to web sling. Of although, I would really love to learn how to web sling if the if I could if I could um. Uh, if I could make my webs uh, shoot out of my wrist without even using any web shooters like Tobey Maguire. And um, let's see. Although. Although he would be. He would be uh, know how to fight because he knows how to like. He he knows like different types of martial arts, and he knows how to like all, all these all these like acrobats and all that stuff. No, for most of you guys who don't know, uh, the origin of Pete, of of Spider Man is um, let's see, it takes you back in Queens, uh, under the name of Peter Parker. So I would say like a I would describe him as a. I, I want to say like a fifteen year old kid. In high school, who has a who has a, an insane crush on this girl named Mary Jane Watson, who apparently who lives next door. You know, as you know, the old cliche like the girl next door, and uh, he, 
and all of a sudden during a field trip there's there's like a, there's like a little science lab and since peter parker uh is like an expert of science um and so somehow one of the spiders went missing so once he was taking a, a picture so with his of his girl of his girl oh mary jane um he wasn't he wasn't his girlfriend at the time he gets bit by a radioactive spider then later on he comes home from with his with his um with his um aunt may and uncle ben he comes home and then he starts feeling the symptoms of a, of a dying of a dying person because obviously if you get bit by a spider you'll die but he wasn't like but i i feel like he was dying he was um well he was like getting like he was getting dizzy so he did so instead of going to the hospital he decided to sleep it off and then eventually when he woke up in the morning he was just like shredded like his his physique cha started changing and then once he um he went once he he was uh eating his lunch at, at the cafeteria he ended up seeing something different like he his his one of the one of the one of the utensils went stuck to his wrist once he would pull it out there was there was like there was like a web like a spider web that's when he discovered he had, he had he had webs coming kind of coming out of his wrist so and you guys we all know the story i'm not going to explain the, the whole the entire thing so um so with that being said can spider-man uh uh exist in in the real world probably not i mean although there are people out there who are no or who, who are good at martial arts they're good at acrobats um and they're good at um actually helping people like like police officers there's firemen there's um there's guidance counselors if you will but i don't think spider-man can exist in real life why because it would be too hard too much crime for him um that he won't have much support like I, if, if if you like i would say like more he wouldn't have any support whatsoever and then not to mention he would he would be on the top list of the fbi for investigating actually he would be going to he would be going to jail pretty much simple as that he would be going to jail he would be um a jail for for what do they say oh oh yeah that's right for um interfering with, with the police investigation which is also a crime so i don't think that that could that could exist in real life and um and that's pretty much it that's all i can give you guys um that's all i can give you guys for pretty much uh thank you guys so much for watching i'm rodolfo cardenas i want you, uh make sure you like make sure you subscribe uh make sure you hit that bell button and uh, turning your post notifications on and uh and i'll see you on the next episode of spider month